Parents are outraged after they say the air conditioning at a local junior high school has been out for days. Two News reporter Dana Smith working for you, finding out what parents are saying and what exactly happened. That's right, Brooke. School ended a little early for some students over at Stivers School of the Arts. Parents say their children simply couldn't focus in all of the heat. Thomas Neely said his 12 year old son called him three times from his school to complain about the heat. Asking for a change of clothes, asking for water, saying it was so hot that he was going to die. Over the past few days, temperatures in the Miami Valley have been at or near 90 degrees. Parents say Stivers has had no AC today or Monday. It's absolutely outrageous. There's no studying getting done, there's no learning getting done right now. It's just a lot of anguish and pain. DPS says they're aware of the problem and are working to get it fixed. They blamed the issue on a power outage. They've been trying to keep parents informed with Facebook posts and say there are plenty of fans in the school. Today, all classes were dismissed at 155 and after school events canceled. But parents believe school shouldn't have been in session in the first place. I did not send him to school today because it's too hot. The children cannot be expected to learn in these kinds of conditions. Ann Jones said her 12 year old son felt ill yesterday when she picked him up from school. When I picked him up, he was completely exhausted, flush faced, felt sick, couldn't eat, just dehydrated and miserable and so I asked him what was going on he said mom my classroom is 98 degrees there's no air blowing and as for whether or not those parents will be sending their kids to school tomorrow they say it all depends on how hot it is and whether or not the school can get the AC fix of course they'll be checking into the DPS Facebook page for updates live in Dayton Dana Smith five on two